Hey everybody, welcome back to another Triple Hound video, and uh, we are back in Assassin's Creed Odyssey after a little bit of time away, uh, focusing on Fortnite for a little while, but we don't want to get uh, sucked into a place where we're only a Fortnite channel, of course, we want to provide some other gameplay from some other games, and that is what brings us back to Assassin's Creed Valhalla, where we are doing a epic, an epic game play, uh, playthrough and stream for you. Uh, this will be episode, I think, 33? Uh, we're... A lot of episodes, anyways. 33, maybe 34, something like that. And um, we have been, in our last couple of episodes, um, digging through members of the Order. So as you can see here, this is our sort of grid of network of uh, members of the Order who are uh, a bunch of bad guys. It's, it's a cabal of um, secretive people who are involved in politics in England and around the world uh, and who are manipulating the world. And we as uh, assassins or pseudo-assassins as the case may be uh, are going through and killing them one by one because that's what we do. And here you can see that we've wiped out a whole bunch of them. And in our last couple of episodes, we've been working our way through this sort of, uh, I don't know, arm or division or something of the order here. In this episode, we are going to deal with the billhook. And this should be a relatively short episode. So the billhook is a two clue person uh, which means that we don't have to do a whole lot to find them and presumably then also kill them. Uh, clue number one is investigate this farm northwest of the town of Lincoln in Lincolnshire. Elfgarston. Elfgarston Farm. If we go to our map, there is a place on the map called Elfgarston, if I'm pronouncing that right. apologize if I'm not. There's a place called Elfgarsten that is approximately northwest of the town of Lincoln. So that is where we are going to go to start our journey. I don't know if this is the farm. I don't really remember. Uh, I went on a tirade through this game a while ago and unlocked as many of these fast travel locations as I could in a moment. So I think I probably cleared this part of the map by doing that. So that's what I'm going to do here. And uh, we have not done the Lincolnshire uh, story arc just yet. So this place is all kind of new for us. The suggestion to attack Lincolnshire as a story arc is 160, as you can see there. And as you can see here, I'm only 153, which frankly is is close enough to probably approach that story arc. I'm not all that concerned about it. But I'm going to make this a relatively small um... Oh, it starts me all the way back here. I'm going to make this a relatively short and sweet video. We're just going to deal with the bill hook and do any other craziness. So, what is the closest fast travel location? Probably Lincolnshire. That way I'll be less likely to be killed by baddies or something. Like I said, uh, Lincolnshire is a 160 area, so I, I mean, I'm it's not so far above my head in terms of level that I can't handle it, but um, it's also a little bit above my head. I don't, I don't want to go picking fights if I don't have to. If this goes anything like the last couple of, um, if this goes anything like the last couple of order members that I assassinated in my travels. Use my own sight just to make sure I'm not surrounded by treasure or something really awesome that I need to pay attention to. Um, where was I? Oh. The last couple of guys that I assassinated in the last couple of videos took less than an hour. Really, they're 
they're like half an hour to 40 minute long adventures for all intents and purposes. The last one took closer to an hour, but that is has nothing to do with how difficult the missions were and everything to do with the fact that it took me like 40 minutes to win a game of dice against some old lady at a bar. And uh, that in and of itself was the majority of that video. So really the in terms of like meaningful adventure and content these things have been like you know half an hour a bear yes i will kill the bear i don't dislike animals but if you gather enough of these um pelts and stuff you can trade them in in your local store, like whatever, your local butcher person for different cool things, so that's why I did that. I'm sorry, I like animals. I like animals too. I took no pleasure in that. Um, anyways, so the last couple of people that we assassinated took, in terms of like meaningful gameplay action, took like half an hour, maybe 20 minutes, and there were three hints to unlocking and killing those people. Oh, hello. Uh, thank you. Uh, and the fact that we're doing somebody now that only takes two hints leads me to believe that this could be a really quick video. This could be our quickest video yet. Um, I think our quickest video prior to this point has been, you know, in the half an hour range or something like that, where we were breaking up our uh, locational ally building story arcs into small chunks of, you know, 30 minutes here and 30 minutes there instead of the more traditional hour and a half to 90 minutes. And uh, this, this could be even shorter than that. I hate to jerk you around in terms of, like, the time these videos are. They're really hard to predict. Hey, buddy. Uh, say, all right, so... I marked on the map where the Lincolnshire, what you call it, Garston. What is this? Usually, when there is an ability to go underground. Farm. Okay, do you have a clue as to where I can find member of the order? Can I go into your house, please. Hello. You have clues. You know, take your thing too, because why not? Um, but you have clues. You see anything I can read? Clues, clues. There. House. What's this one? Or this one. Old lady. Just kind of walking into people's houses. A bar or anything? Thing anywhere? Okay. Ooh, what's this? Bandit's note. Blah 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 blah. friends in this little farm because I'm just walking around taking my friends. Okay. That house, that house, that house, that house. Okay, we're running out of houses here, ladies and gentlemen. And aha. The last, it's always the last place you look. Of course, why would you keep looking? Now, you know who the bill hook is. A bearded dude. Named Havelock. Uh, whatever. I'm interested in while I'm in the neighborhood. Okay, so we found it. It took a little while, but we found it. It was the last house on our list. What is this treasure? I'm intrigued. 
big, I tell you. Uh, yep, in here. Thank you. Supplies. Oh, I definitely need supplies. That rocks. Hey, thanks for giving me your things. Uh, so, I think we ended up going into each and every one of these houses. Uh, yeah, we're not going to make any friends at this farm, but they just seem to be okay with us kind of walking through and taking all the things. And we are going to now jump into our little map of order, people. Let's see. There he is. Assassinate the bill hook. He can be found at his villa at the foot of a wall near Lincoln's Town Hall in Lincolnshire. Platinus Havelock. Oh, he's like a another uh, Roman sounding dude. Havelock came to Lincolnshire as a young man with the great heathen army. A member of the order recognized Havelock's quick and ruthless intelligence and introduced him to the Crozier. As an apprentice to the Crozier, Havelock gained stature and experience. He now is an established landholder and farmer in Lincoln, where he bribes the Shire soldiers to do his bidding. This is the note that we used. Let's mark him. could get interesting because we're not Lincoln is not a place that we have established as a sort of um, friend of ours like there this is not an allied territory to put, to put behind it. you know what I could do why am I wasting this time walking why walk when you can fast travel so Lincoln is not on our network of places who have sworn allegiance to us, and therefore I cannot run around in this town with impunity. In places where we've already gone through the... Uh, we can kind of run around wherever the hell we want, and it's not a big deal. In Lincoln, that is not the case. We have not done the Lincoln story arc, I don't think. Unless I'm just forgetting about it. We've done 32 episodes, so maybe I'm just forgetting about it. But... Uh, I think Lincoln is still uncharted or un unallied territory, which means we need to kind of be careful how we move around. Could I just slaughter all of the bad guys in this town? Yes. Um, will I do that? Will that be like unnecessarily time consuming for this particular quest? Also, yes. Um, where the hell is he? Over there. This should be like a distrust zone, if I'm not mistaken. Need to cloak myself here. Yeah, look at that. She stuck her hood on while jumping. It's the most athletic thing she's ever done. All right. I take that back. She climbs like 200 foot cliff faces with just her fingertips. So no, that wasn't the most athletic thing she's ever done. If this is, if, like, this is a case where I can just walk up to this person and kill them, let me see where this house is relative to where I am. Does it make sense to go through this rampart here, or does it make sense to go around this rampart here? Looks like around is going to be the smart one. Right, bird, come on back. 45 minute loading time. That's the thing. So I can't like run over there with my knife out and all of that jazz. Uh, because then everybody around me will grasp their pearls and gasp surprisedly when I walk by. But if I walk like this, slowly and boringly, it will um, not result in any conflict. Doop -doop. Walking along, singing a song. Hey, hey. Hey, 
Expertino, after me, net, comes Somebody is whistling who doesn't really know how to whistle, and they're just doing it like sort of the amateurish way. Come on, learn how to whistle if you're gonna whistle. Otherwise, sing a sea shanty or something. Come up with some other way to create music if you can't do it right. Just walking through the town here. Is there any stairs, or am I gonna like fall? Breeze in. Okay, everybody okay? Okay. We got some Roman ruins out here. That's kind of cool. I like history. Come on, get down. I don't need to creep, just. Okay. In this house, I guess? There he is. Let's walk around here so we don't have to climb on things. Is he, like, by himself? Is he just in this house by himself with no bodyguard? Or... Okay, is, is the door locked or something? Is there anything about this that's going to make it difficult? Is this going to be like a... This is going to be like a 10-minute video. And... Huh. Okay. How was that, huh? Boss battle! The first man I killed for my order, I cried and wept after trying to hold back the tears. But I told myself, I am merely acting upon a foretold destiny, navigating the whim of greater gods. My actions are simply pebbles. Pebbles that wash away in the surf, as harmless as dust. Pebbles were once bedrock. As were you. Like the Flintstones, for me? Uh, okay. Dude is dead. And that was super easy. Barely an inconvenience. Uh, we got a note from him and an order of the medallion, or order of the Ancients medallion. Let's take a look at all of this. Okay, inventory first and foremost. I assume this is, like, the literally just going to be... Oh, oh, hey, what do we got here? care about these is when... The, um... There is an Assassin's Bureau in my settlement of Ravensthorpe, which is hilarious to me. The, the secret brotherhood of assassins has a little storefront in my town that has a Assassin logo on its sign. I just think that's hilarious. It's not all that secretive at all. Anyways... Uh, I pop in every so often once I have a bunch of these things and give them to the assassin who works there and he just he gives me like a special power or something. So I think I think I need nine in order for him to give a damn and I've got four people to kill. Uh, what is this? Oh, brown bear for deer hoof. These are just mementos from the animals I've been slaughtering on my way. Uh, okay. Let's go to the order. So we have learned more about who the liar is. The liar, the liar has brown hair with a brown mustache and goatee. The liar performs music on a stage. Eliminate any target from the same branch to find the next clue. One, two, three, four, five. We have found five clues. Lives in Grantbridge. Spends much of his time browsing the market. Grant Bridge. Grant Bridge is a place where we have allies. It's only been 20 minutes, guys. So, uh, we have killed the billhook. We have done what we wanted to accomplish in this playthrough video. Um, and I don't really want to launch into a whole nother... Grant Bridge. So this dude is here somewhere. We have five of the six clues, and he is here somewhere. Now, 
this guy, the Crozier, a nobleman in Lincolnshire, is a member of the Order of Ancients. So, this doesn't mean anything to me. Uh, we need to continue the story to find the next clue, as it says down here. So, in order to find the Crozier, and therefore uh, kill him and get the clues necessary to get the last clue for our friend the liar, we have to play through the story arc, I, I assume, of Lincolnshire, based on the fact that this guy is a nobleman in Lincolnshire, and it says continue the story to find the next... Oh. Uh, Lincolnshire is going to be a three-hour story arc. So what we're... What I'm getting at here is that it's going to take three hours of gameplay to find this clue t to unlock who this guy is. That said, I'm just, just bullshitting here. What if we were to go to Grant Bridge and try to skip all of this? I'm doing this in real time. This is unedited gameplay, as you know. Uh, what if we were to skip all of this? Go to Grant Bridge. See if we can just find this dude. Let's fast travel to Grant Bridge. Let's see if we can just find this dude based on what we know. He's got a mustache, plays music or something. Um, he likes to walk around the market. Um, so maybe let's go to the market. Um, let's go to the market and walk around and see if uh, we can figure out, like, find a guy with, I don't know, uh, find a guy with a mustache and who appears to be... around all right so let's review let's review this this may be fruitless this may mean nothing we may not get anywhere has brown hair brown mustache and a goatee performs music on a stage he's a man losing grants some of his time browsing in the market can we just skip all of the tomfoolery and skip straight to killing him we're going to go to the market, we're going to look for a guy with a mustache and goatee, maybe performing on stage. What is this? A sickle. Essex. Is Essex a place where I am out of my league? Nothing we can do with this. You're gonna go to the market here in Grant Bridge. Grant Bridge is one of the first places where we. Thank you. Grant Bridge is one of the first places where we kind of built an alliance. I'm gonna stretch this thing out for a few more minutes, just on a whim. Just on a whim. To farm. Maybe it'll be nothing. Next video, we'll take a look at the sickle and see if we can't nail down the sickle. It looks like a female based on the silhouette. Market. Do you see a market anywhere? This looks like a market up here. Oh, this is where it's at. Now this could be a case where you can't, you actually cannot get this person uh, without doing all the clues first. This could be one of those cases. Excuse me. Do you have a mustache? No. You know, some games are like that. You like the person does not appear on the map until after you have done all of the things you need to do. Some stuff cooking here. Is this even the market, or is this just like a place where there's a bunch of dead animals? I don't even know.
arms on stage, huh? Stage somewhere? Let's keep looking. I'm not, I'm not going to give up yet. Everybody is a child here. Where are your parents, everyone? Okay. Feels like a person. Let's not have a goatee. Looking for a goatee. I wish I could speak to these people. Excuse me. You know of an... Oh, that's like a Christmas decoration. Nice. Um... Excuse me, do you know of anybody who performs on stage or shops the local market, has a goatee, plays instruments, looking for musicians and stuff? This is not looking promising. I am going to go out on a limb. Is this a stage? All the world is a stage. Is this a stage? You're not who I'm looking for. You do not have a mustache. Um, hmm. All right. I think... I think this might be one of those situations where you actually just cannot kill this guy... Like he doesn't appear until you have unlocked all of the clues. So he's not... I don't think he's here. I don't think he appears until we've done all of that stuff. As much as I hate to say it, as much as I don't want to spend three hours going through a geographic story arc so that I can unlock one clue that is really, frankly, what seems like a formality... So I can find this one guy and kill him. Um, I think that's what I'm ultimately going to have to do. What I will do, just in case, is go up to their longhouse and see if there is a... I will go up to their longhouse and see if there is a stage inside the longhouse where somebody might... There's like nobody at the... There's nobody at this market. That's in fact what they hear. Excuse me, do you have a mustache? Hey, is that what you're doing all the way out here? Do you, do you have a mustache? There's nobody here. This is the most pathetic market I have ever been to. There's like nobody... There's nobody here. Much less the liar. Okay. Hey, any of you guys... guys do not have goatees. They have beards. It's different. A goatee? You play music? Ooh, this dude has a goatee. talk to you. I'll follow you, Abel, to glory and Valhalla. Uh, I will wait for the day I earn a place at your side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Quite you. I don't know what that was, but I took it. Alright, we're going to kill a little bit more time looking for treasure. I think we're in a situation here where we cannot get down. Where we cannot, like, we, they won't let us find this guy until we the clues, which is too bad. We wanted to kill him. That would have been fun. 
dead. Tick. Uh, okay. That was sort of pointless. Anyways, I guess that's what I get. Ooh, key. I guess that's what we are going to stop with. Let's call that a day. Uh, I will do my little outro here. I'll take this lady's key. Out. Pick the lock. Um, so that'll be that. I'll attempt to kill her off camera and see what happens. Uh, there's some cute cats walking around here. Thank you so much for watching. Um, we stretched that out a little bit. Turns out you cannot find, um, you cannot find the next person on the list until or unless uh, you have gone through all of the clues. At least I couldn't. Uh, maybe somebody else has had a different experience. Leave that in the comments below if in fact that's the case. And uh, yeah, well, bye. Kill this lady or not? How do I get the key from her? Anyways. For another time. See you later, everyone.